So this is our third and final video on how to search for patents. Uh, this video is presented by patentfile.org, which is a provisional patent filing resource for inventors. And this whole presentation is available on the website patentfile.org. So in this example, we're going to talk about searching patent classes. Before I do that, I'm going to go back to our Google patent search and take another look at the patent class system. So here we are back at our Google patent screen. As you can see, they have a little heading here for current US patent class system. And as I've started to notice that I've been writing down as I'm doing my searching, that I keep seeing this 114 slash 347 or 114 slash 363 um, patent class system. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over to the US PTO website. The address is USPTO.gov slash web slash patents slash classification. And this is going to bring up my patent class search screen. And so I'm going to type in my 114-347 and see what that brings up. And as it turns out, if I scroll up to the very top here, class 114 has to do with ships. So apparently my canoe seat is going to fall under this larger category of ships. So 114-347 has to do with canoes or kayaks. So that's great. That's, a, that's probably a good class for me to search in. And remember, we also had the class 114-363. And so 114-363 has to do with seats and foot support for boats or boat components. So either one of these classes would be a good area for me to kind of dive into and search. And so the way you can do that from this patent screen is every time you see a blue A, that will link you to currently pending patent applications that are in that class and subclass. Wherever you see a red P, if you click on that, that will pull up all of the issued patents in that class or subclass. So let's go to our class 114347 and click on the red P button. button. And again, this is for the canoe or kayak class. And this says that it found 288 issued patents, because we're in the P section, P for patents, uh, 288 issued patents that were in the class relating to canoes or kayaks. And so you can either start clicking through these one at a time, or an even better strategy would be to click the link up here that says quick, and that's going to open up a, a, the USPTO search screen. And again, this is for issued patents. And I'm going to type in 114, comma, 347, which was our class subclass relating to canoes and kayaks. In the drop-down field, I'm going to change this to current US classification. And then I can start playing around with different uh, search terms that I'm interested in. So for my hypothetical example, we're doing a canoe seat. So if I type in seat, and let's say I just choose the title field and hit search, I get about 16 results. So these are going to be very closely related to my invention because these should all be seats in the canoe or kayak subclass. And then so you can start playing around with different terms um, like foldable seat or floating seat um, or, or all the different terms for your invention. And the problem with um, the US Patent Office search system is that when you click on uh, one of their patents, this is the screen that you get and you can see it's not as clean or as crisp as Google. It doesn't give you the images. It doesn't give you the link uh, to download the PDF. So I hate to tell you to go back, but really I like to go back to Google Patents Advanced Search Screen and then under the current US classification 
we can type in our class 114347 and then in the title screen type in seat hit search and we have a lot better easier to navigate searching system so I hope this video was helpful for you um, please visit our, visit our website patentfile.org to learn more about provisional patents and other neat patent searching tricks thank you